guy backing up there, man. Pay attention. Because I got Nick, Nick Lash already. Hold up, man. I got Nick Whiplash already. You see what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So you have to understand the ramification of it, man. Mm -hmm. So, mm -hmm. so I, I mean, I mean, you, you know, Floyd came through an era where he got by with a lot of stuff. In the old days, down the mind, he wouldn't got away with all that stuff he was doing. See, the era is different, but it's the same. Same players, they're just smarter. Mm -hmm. So it, the old players, Floyd wouldn't have been able to, to do what he needed to do. So when people praise Al Heyman, what have Al Heyman brought to the game? Floyd was already rich from being in the top rank. He might have gave him some corners, but you, but he don't know this business. Who is he? Talking about his advisor, Al Heyman. So, you know, listen, I've often heard, wait a minute now, because I don't want to, I don't want to, oh, no, wait, I don't want to jump on the bandwagon of Jason Cross because I know you and him again, what you have going, sir, but you often speak quite ill of a fellow by the name of Al Heyman, sir, and I don't, I don't, I don't really want to, want to be a part of any of that. Uh, poison, but, 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 but I always, I always said his guys, his brother was our fighter. Bobby Heyman was our guy with DK. Bobby Heyman was with us. Well, wait till this Bobby Heyman fellow fight, sir. I never heard of him personally, sir. That's his brother, Bobby Heyman. Sir, I, let me tell you. Retired 24 from... and 6. We got him one shot at the title. He can take him to the pencil and right, just let's fight. What title are we talking about, sir? What title did he fight? He Who got his shot fight, at sir? the middleweight title. WBC title. I don't know. What, I, I can't remember. What the... Must have been fighting Rodrigo Valdez, sir, or maybe Monzon, sir. No, he wasn't Carlo Monzon. Maybe it was Valdez. No, I wasn't Rodrigo Valdez knocking Benny Briscoe's goddamn head off, knocking clean the uh, because, the ring. because Russell wasn't smart. Russell was, was see, Russell played himself out. He shouldn't have went over there. You number one, you do it on neutral ground. Don told him, you let me do it. <laughs> It'll be done in the garden. Mm -hmm. But he didn't want to get in the bed. Sometimes you gotta get in the bed with the snakes. Or order to get what you want, bro. Yeah, yeah, I guess so. I'm, 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 I mean, we are now at 108th Street, coming up to 109th Street. We're up in Harlem, gentlemen. Is that where we are? Yay, nay, maybe. I don't know where this is. Getting getting close. Getting close to uptown. We're, okay. on, we're on Amsterdam. We're up here in New York City. Me and my good friend Ramel, my, my producer and uh, director, Ramel and I have been violating every rule of the coronavirus. <laughs> every single root solitary rule. And working me like a government mule. And another thing <laughs> and I like And I ain't to, getting paid. Everything I, I like I go to stay at home and find me a $2 old hook in my bill. So I get to <laughs> with this guy. You will get that money out your pocket. Brother, brother. Another, you uh, no, I'm not, I'll settle up with you some more once I get the, uh, I got to get to an ATM. Or yeah, I know, I know you will, baby. You will, baby. Yeah, but, 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 but listen, but what I'm saying, I always, you've heard me always say that Floyd one of the greatest businessmen in this business next to Ali. Totally. I've always said that. Totally, sir. I just don't see what it is. And I think, Brother Joe, you being a producer, if if these if these organizations and these networks are put these exercise the I even the brother Joe uh, a, a, a morality contract. You know the networks make you sign the minority. I even announce the morality. minority. Morality. The morality. The morality contract. Right. A lot of these organizations and these uh, organizations and, and these sanctioned bodies don't push that. But they push that. A lot of these guys like, like Tank and Floyd and all these other guys. Oh, right. Like okay. Oh, you know what? I understand what you're saying. I'm missing. You mean the morality contract. Basically, yeah. you got to yeah, conduct that's, your, that's, You have to conduct yourself in a certain that's way. That's why I asked him because I know he's, no, he's a producer. Right. And that's why I asked you, Brother Joe. No, that's for Melvin. Brother sir. Romel, that's why I asked you. Because yeah. I know you know about that. Yeah. So. Yeah, well, they ain't, they, man, they ain't going to look. I don't care if you beat this broad up, man. If you're going to help me make like five, half, half a billion dollars. But you know views, what? You know? See, in the old days, if you did that, you got a business. Yeah, okay, you're absolutely right. You got a business. Yeah. People See, can... first of all, when you come out of Grand Rapids, Michigan, when you got a father, Shooting at your mother almost kill you while you in the arms. You know you ain't gonna be too right. We, we talking about Floyd Mayweather Senior, sir. Floyd shooting, Senior shooting at his uh shooting at his uh Floyd's mother while Floyd was in his arm. In her, in, in her, her arms. arms. 
Well, maybe that's why Floyd's defense is so good, sir. He started out ducking that bullet. <laughs> Maybe that's maybe that's why this Floyd is a, here, is a defensive mastermind. This guy here, man. Well, I mean, man. it's something to think about, sir. But you make a point. You know, it's something to think about. It's ready for the match. That's a lot of good. You know, now this joint here, over here, I heard it was good. If Davis goes there when he come over to my house, yeah. Now it's not. It's his clothing store now. Yeah. Oh shit! They ain't even in business no yeah, more. Yeah. So he he uh, would bring. Bring me some food from a spot up here. There's a spot. Yeah, introduce me to old Xavier one day. There's man. a spot. Let me see if he's home. Because he's right around the corner from where we're going. Folks, so that you know, we are up in Harlem. Yes, we are. We're up in Harlem where Malcolm X used to storm the gates up here. Yeah. And also, uh, what we're doing, what are we? What are we getting ready to pass the Apollo Theater? Although I will not be showing it to you. You have to take, Apollo my, is take my word for it. And also, okay. folks, that crazy-ass white dude, uh, Billy on the Streets, do a lot of filming in and around New York City. So that's what we got going on. And we have my good friend and colleague and elder brother, uh, Leon Muhammad, a man that I've known. Uh, a Hall of Famer. For years. Okay, the man's a Hall of Famer, and he's been inducted in various boxing Hall of Fame organizations for his challenge. The country boy. You know, the country boy. This man has a book. Tell him about your the book. The Rise and Fall will be... On the shelf this Friday. There you on go. the shelf. There you go. Get your book. Rise and Fall of the Country Boy. There you go. Tell them how they could get it, sir. You can get it by calling 843-781-9195. I'm going to put the number in the caption, sir. So they don't Dr. Know. Susan R. Kahn. We'll put it in the caption. With the author. Good young lady out of Charleston, South Carolina. We put it in the captions, sir, and the people will know to get your book. Matter of fact, I'm going to put that on the captions as we ride. Starting from the beginning, sir, I'm going to do an intro to it. I hope you do something to it. Okay. Because Slow down there, get in your right hand line. We're going to turn, sir. I think we are. What is this? African Square, sir. Yeah. Make a turn, turn here, here, sir. Turn here. Okay, sir. Okay. More white people now in Harlem than black people, Chris. sir. Yeah. This is 125th? 124th now, sir, and going down. Slow down, man. That might be out of business, sir. Slow down. You know that the black people ain't going to support the soul food spot, and the white people going to get tired of it. Man, you know that? The one he took me to was Africa. Fabric. No, that's not it. Slow down, slow down. Look on your left hand side. That look like something right there, say or something. I don't know. The African cuisine, right there. Right there. That's Part it over, over here. I'm gonna find the place. Walk back over there. 